We head back to the voicemail of Truth and Reason. Uh, this caller has a question um, about a guy he'd like to see extended quickly. Yes, this is Keith calling from Columbus, Ohio. Go Browns. I'm calling in regards to the Denzel Ward conversation. That is one player that on our defense outside of Miles that I do not want to see gone. I've even heard the receiver from the Bengals say he's the best defensive back I've faced since I've been in the league. He is top tier. We have to figure out a way to re-sign him. I understand we got Newsom, and I like Newsom, but he is not Denzel. Um, I just think Denzel is an intricate part of that defense, that lockdown corner, and when you already have one of the best receivers giving him his props like that, someone within the division on top of that, I just think that that itself just goes a long way. So that's my opinion. Tell me what you think. As always, appreciate all of uh, the voicemails. And, Jeff, I'm with them. I think I think you need two really good corners, especially when you're going to be playing the Bengals a couple of times a year. Um, you're going to need guys that can run all over the field. Absolutely. And, and Pittsburgh still has receivers that they don't have a quarterback, but they do have <laughs> receivers that are dangerous. you got to be able to cover those guys because Mitchell Trubisky might be able to throw it at some point. Um, somebody that they draft might be able to do that too. Yeah, I'm, I'm absolutely with them. You need two good corners. And again, we talked about a little bit earlier, the fact that you don't have premium draft picks anymore, that means you can't let premium talent walk out the door because you don't have any means to replace them. This is a guy, look, he, he's a Cleveland guy. Uh, he, he loves being here. He, he is a very good player. He's one of the best cover corners in the NFL. He has a little bit of a durability concern, but the, we, we've learned to live with that. That's one of the reasons why you need to have some depth on the, on the roster. I love it. Lock him up for as long as he wants. He, he needs to be one of the five highest paid cornerbacks in the NFL. He's he's earned that. He's proven that. And, and the Browns need to make that happen. I'm, I'm, I'm with, I think his name was Keith from Columbus there. Mm -hmm. uh, make it happen. Uh, I'm, I'm with him. That, that should be a priority of business. This is not a guy that you want to let leave the building. Yeah, I agree with you. And, and again, they're still working through. You got the $19 million in essence for Baker Mayfield on the cap. You've got Deshaun Watson coming onto the cat. Hey, they got some gymnastics to work through. He's under contract for this year. Um, I'm sure. I, I believe, and, and I know we've we've had guests on here that think they may let him go just because of the price tag. Um, I don't necessarily think that's going to happen. I think I think they value corners pretty uh, pretty substantially in that defense. So we'll see. Again, they got to work through. They got so many cap gymnastics they're working through right now. Um, they got to work through those first. 